This video is a record of a visit to Malmesbury Marms recently. Malmesbury is a part of the Gold Rush Centre of Victoria and dates back to 1856. The main street is very short, it's just a small little town. There is plenty of heritage buildings to see and a lot of history. Dates back to 1856. That's the extent of the main shopping centre, only about a dozen shops. These are historic pictures of what Malmesbury was like in the beginning, a mining community. We shared a meal at the bakery here. This is the baker's shop. There's an old door which has been done in contemporary stained glass. Thought it was interesting. It's a beautiful day to be out and the sun was out and people sitting on the footpath having a meal rather than be inside. This is the primary school, a very interesting little place with nothing here and has some very interesting little There they are there, all that in ceramics. They look very nice, but they are of great interest. Let me show you the bell tower of the school, for ring the school bell. That's very old. This is the notice board for St John's Church outside, of course we'll show you the church in a moment.
This is the start of the viaduct, which was built in 1856. That's the train going across the viaduct over the Campaspe River. The viaduct is the largest viaduct built in Australia in 1859-60 out of blue stone. It is 149 metres long and 22 metres above the river. It cost 72,000 pounds to build at the time it was built. It's a remarkable piece of work, stone masonry, and it stood the test of time since all that time, and the train still uses it. The river is very low at the moment because there's not enough rain, but I guess it must expect a flood to have the viaduct so high. That's the remains of the Compaspe River when it's low, just a pool underneath the viaduct. Very restful with some horses resting in, under the trees. Bye-bye.